We're going to make a Maltese lemon and almond drink today called Rugiata. It's basically very quick to make, contains quite a lot of sugar. You can use stevia if you wish, but it doesn't achieve exactly the same results. We're having a look at the recipe. For Maltese Rugiata, we need two liters of water, six cloves, the juice of a lemon, the rind of half a lemon, one teaspoon of almond essence, a cinnamon stick and a kilo of sugar. For this drink, we use regular almond essence. I'm following a very old traditional recipe and that's what they used to do. It was obviously part of the Maltese kitchen, very frugal, and that's my almond essence. I've also got some lemon juice here, my water, some sugar, I'm using caster sugar. As I said, you could use stevia, but we're looking for a syrupy consistency because the idea is to have something like cordial and keep it in the fridge and add water. It keeps in the fridge in the summer, in the moldy summer for about a month. And then some fresh lemons, some cloves, and also a cinnamon stick. I'm starting with some water into my pot. And with that water, I'm going to add some cloves, some whole cloves, so that we can strain it and remove them. I'm also adding a whole cinnamon stick my almond essence, some lemon juice, and then I'm going to chop up some lemons and use the rind so that we can bring it to a boil and then simmer it for about 15 minutes. We've got our lemon rind cut up and I'm going to add that to our water. And finally, I'm going to add my sugar and I'm using caster sugar. We need about a kilo with the amount of water that we're using because I'm after a cordial. So when that cooks, we're going to add, we're going to add water to it. So once our mixture starts boiling, I'm going to turn the heat down and let it simmer for 15 minutes. So that's simmered for 15 minutes and I'll just pass it through the sieve and strain it. And 
and ideally I like to let this cool down at room temperature then cover it up and leave it in the fridge for at least an hour before I transfer it to some jars or bottles but this is simply a cordial which we're going to add to some water. We're ready to serve our rujata. The Maltese countryside at the moment is full of this fresh fennel and I've made some ice cubes here using the flowers of the fennel just to make a very pretty drink. So we start with the ice cubes. I've cooled down my cordial and I store it in the fridge in bottles, glass bottles preferably. But um, I'm ready to pour my drink. And the traditional Maltese way is to add some evaporated milk to our lemon drink, to our rojata. That changes the color completely. I'm adding my lemon slices now and also finally this is not part of the recipe this is something which I've added myself my ice cubes with fennel seeds. Going to have a look at the recipe again. For our Maltese Reggiata, our drink of almond and lemon, we need two litres of water, six cloves, the juice of a lemon, the rind of half a lemon, I've actually put the rind of a whole one today, one teaspoon of almond essence, a cinnamon stick, a kilo of sugar and finishing it off with about five or six spoonfuls of evaporated milk. I'm now ready to pour my rojata into the glasses. you'll try out this Maltese recipe and you'll find more information and recipes on my blog.